Thank you very much to you, to Congress, my partisan support, to White House, to President, and thank you. Uh, we have really big support from the United States. You are leaders in it. Without you, we, I think, can't win in this war, but we have to because we are fighting for, for our values and our children. And we appreciate all the help all the support that you've done, uh, not only for our army, also financial support for our people, teachers, medicine, etc. And that is very important. And really, I wanted to thanks to big political support. It's very important to be in this period and you know in this um, united regime which is very important for us for europe i think this unity makes closer us to the moment of uh, the occupation of our country and we are very happy that we are not alone in this war because i think we are against real terrorists from from russia real terrorists that they really want just to you know, occupied our country just to kill our people. And that's it. I don't see any global uh, creative ideas from Putin and etc. We see really his ambition that he has. He wants to occupy us. That's it. We and so we are really thankful for that help and your steps of Americans, of ordinary people of society are very important that these steps are near us so together with us i mean so thank you so much thanks for coming well, mr president thank you for seeing us this is my second trip here um to show our support and our continued uh, commitment uh, to to ukraine um you have um uh, you have given inspiration to the world in your uh, fight for democracy you're on the, the front lines um and uh it is uh, is our honor to continue to support uh ukraine's efforts um, we have in our delegation members from the Intelligence Committee and the Armed Services Committee, uh, two committees that oversee significant amounts of the, the coordination uh, that we have. What Mike has said is true, and I know you've heard this many, many times, uh, but you've inspired not only your nation, you've inspired the world in many ways. Uh, and we're grateful for that, for the courage you've shown. And it's interesting that we hoped and expected because uh, our understanding of the Ukrainian people that you would fight. And, uh, but Vladimir Putin didn't think he would fight. And I'm glad you've surprised him.